Hi, my name is Vanessa, and we'll be installing a new lumen sensor. You will need a lumen sensor, five cable ties, two lumen sensor screws, six case screws, a 2.5 millimeter hex key, clippers, and a Phillips head screwdriver. Begin by removing the new limit sensor. Take one of the screws and attach the sensor to the spine of the case, making sure that the cables run downward. Secure it with the second screw. Push the wire through the hole behind the vat area and pull through. Continue to feed the wire through the front of the case past the mirror. Take the first cable tie and secure the cables underneath the limit sensor. Be sure to keep the square insert on the tie on the outside section of the case away from the motor and moving parts. Add a secondary tie directly underneath the last, just under the vat level. Follow along the frame and add two more cable ties. One behind the galvas and one just in front. Add the last tie just in front of the mirror. Clip the excess, being careful not to cut any wires. Organize the remaining wire around the mirror and out of the path of the laser. Connect it to the connector labeled Y limit. Don't force the pins. Keep in mind that the connector only goes one way. Rotate the panel upwards and secure it in place. Lastly, to check that your sensor is functioning, Bring the motor down and we'll set and test the motor homing. Before you begin printing, ensure that it's calibrated and leveled. We are just setting the homing to test the sensor. Go to the settings, calibrate the motor, and set the motor homing.
Next, test the motor homing to bring the plate back down. Run the test one more time. If the sensor is functioning properly, it'll hit the sensor and return down.